Uh, hello guys, uh, today I have finished uh, S-Drive Nano and I want to show you how does it work, uh, how uh, the user shall operate the device. So let's step in to the device. The device is fitted inside sm small transparent uh, CO plug. It has a micro, micro SD slot. We put the SD card here. Uh, please don't look, look at the buttons. They will be much shorter. Uh, it's just prototype. Device will look like this. And you plug it into the back of your computer. Okay, that's the first step. The second step, on a micro SD card, you have to put uh, S drive load file that is present in the download section of my uh, site. You press the card inside and you start the Atari. Look, observe the LEDs. And now look at the screen. Okay, we've got, we've got four drives available and let's assign, let's assign to drives different files. Let's say Sapper is going to be uh, D1, Ninja Commando D2, Frogger D3, I don't like this game, Jet Set Willy D4. Right now, in this moment, four different files uh, are assigned to different disk drives D1, D2, D3, D4. It's most important that you must remember which files you have assigned to the drives. So, let's back to the device. As you see, the green LED is light LED. It means D1 drive, D1 drive is active. Let's reset the computer. Sorry for the disturbance of picture. We've got, we've got game loaded. As you remember, on the drive number two, we have assigned different game. So let's press this button for the next drive. We've got orange light now. It means now you have selected the second drive. Let's reset the computer. Red light indicates loading routine. Okay, honestly, I don't remember what game was assigned to the D2. Oh, Ninja Commando, wonderful, works. Let's back, go back. Now we have press next drive. We have blue light. It means the drive number three is now ready and active. Let's reset the Atari. Wait a moment, I have to... Okay, Atari. Now we have game number three loading. From disk drive three, only middle I see. Yes, of course. And we have Frogger. Ray, it works. Now let's switch to the, the drive four. Of course, sorry, uh, there will be another uh, LED, but I have only white LED by hand. And let's reset the Atari. Now 
Jets and Willy, yes. And to be honest, this is the best Atari music ever. See, thank you. Okay, let's back to the device. Uh, let me put the volume down. Okay. And, and now, what happens if you press next drive? If you press the next drive, the cycle will go to the first drive. Previous, next, previous, next, previous, next. Okay, we've got first drive active. And now the question rises, how to reset device to start bootloader? Very simple. Press two buttons at the same time. And the effect is load and loads again. So, actually, actually, that's all. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, enjoyed my new glasses. <laughs> I got old, sorry. And uh, hope to hear from you soon.